Good morning, Cobras. I'm Jacob. And I'm Anna, coming to you from the Cobra Den News Studio. Today is Monday, January 23rd, and here is your Cobra News for the week. And here's Ashlyn, rolling in with the joke of the week. Hey, how do you make a hot dog stand? You take away its chair! <laughs> My name's Trinity. Now let's get to everyone's favorite part of the day, lunch. Here's what's on the menu for this week at Cockwood Middle School. On Monday, pizza or a barbecue meatball. On Tuesday, pizza or oven roasted chicken fajitas. On Wednesday, pizza or hot and spicy chicken tenders. On Thursday, pizza sub or chalky pinwheel. And on Friday, chicken or sloppy joe. Sounds delicious. Now to what's happening this week at the Cockwood Middle School. This week's word of the week is luscious. Luscious means something that smells delicious or has great smell. You can use it in a sentence by saying the famous chocolate cake is served with a luscious peppermint cream topping. Whip cream. This week's Cobra Spotlight is a Cobra Girls basketball team. Shout out to the Cobra Girls basketball team for being an excellent example of Cobra pride. Hello, I'm Anna, and today we're with Coach McCorder. And today I'll be interviewing her on the bas girls basketball team. What was the most memorable moment of the season? The most memorable moment for me, we were down 11 to zero to start the Northeast game. And we ended up coming back and winning by 15. So that really shows the girls have a lot of fight within them. Hmm. Can you describe an obstacle or a challenge that the team had to overcome this season and how they were able to overcome it? I think our biggest obstacle was early. We got super overconfident and then didn't take practices seriously. We ended up losing our last game to Kenwood. It was a really close game. So they kind of came together and started holding each other accountable. And now practices are way, way better. Hmm. What was being a student athlete mean to the girl, the Cobra girls on the basketball team? I would say being a really good role model for the community, but also holding themselves to a high standard so that Kirkwood is held to a high standard as well. And finally, what do you or your team look forward to in the next season? I really look forward to working with the JVers. Um, we're losing eight, no, nine eighth graders this year. So that's a lot of big shoes to fill. Uh, but it excites me because the JV team went undefeated this season. So I think we can only go up from here. And that was Coach McCorder. This is Ann. And Lena with your weekly trivia. The answer to last week's trivia question, what was the first soft drink in space, is Coca-Cola. Who knew? And this week's trivia question is, who wrote the Star Spangled Banner? Thank you for watching the cover news. We'll, we'll see, see you again, again next week. week.